Hey everybody, Cindy A. Lewis here, and it is the end of July. How many of you feel like this month flew by? Well, I'm raising my hand because it flew by, and it was so much fun, and it was so packed with goodness. So I hope that if nothing else, you saved the playlist, the Christmas Planner playlist, so that you can come back and grab any of the suggestions that were in any of the videos when you're making your planner or your junk journal or a December daily. I mashed it all up into one here for this year and what a fun one and it's chunky already so we've still got half of the month to finish filling in pages for all right let's start with the outside for the flip through um we covered a book and put the hardware on made a little pocket for the front let's just show you real quick i don't have um have anything in the pocket but it can hold a little something something you could put the base pages in there because they're a part of this uh for the inspiration um the ta uh, tassel and the charm dangle are right here so beautiful and then of course we've got our closure here with a key and a charm inside is a pocket on the inside. We did a hidden a spine, so you cannot see the stitching on the outside. The planner pages are all right here at the beginning with the calendar for November and then the calendar for December. I did print these on parchment paper. So this whole signature is sewn in separately and then there was a few of the pages um, that I still wanted to include so they're in this second signature here at the back and so day one um, inspiration by my my day one in the base base um, pages PT for pocket then day two for the hidden prompt um this opens up and there is a little hidden spot for journaling here and you just tuck that in so if any of you are patreon members when you get your patreon mail make sure you open your hidden and this is also a belly band uh, this was inspired by emerald mama's creations this also is a frame uh, page inspired by Thrifty Day, including a little tuck uh, pocket, not really a tuck, a pocket on my brown bag here. Then we skipped over to this page, which was the envelope, embossed the envelope, put a um, inside to it made it also a pocket as well and this by crafty uh, Aries Katie for envelope prompt then the door prompt from Raven vintage and CA on Instagram and 2778 on YouTube then the flip black whisper crafts aka Bex and these are little flips and then you can add your journaling behind there you could add more you could even add something here if you want to then here is the multi or multiple so you have all these multiple places belly and you know, like pockets belly bands pockets tags really fun one and that was let's design creative the next one was a prompt for eight for windows so this envelope um, has a window in it and you just slide your picture or whatever behind there and you can see it through that window that was eight the prompt for nine was um, tuck with scraps to craft so just a bunch of tuck spots on one page so we have this one here 
on those, all of those and that. And then I did a short one on this side. That was day nine. Day 10 was removable. And so this pocket is actually removable. Has a tall pocket, a short pocket, another pocket here. Um, really fun from Cheaply Chic. And we skipped over and this is actually um, your um, tuck, um, tip in. This is your tip in. I put tuck in, but it's a tip in. So I need to fix that. Let me just write that tip in. Tip in. <laughs> I'll fix it later. But anyway, this is from Madeline Deet. I don't know if that's how she says it. Um, designs and so you have a bunch of little tip ends which are hinged by one side and on this one I used a little uh, vellum and then put that little pocket inside the um, inside there's a little pocket out of a journaling card and then of course a pocket here then this was all day 11. Day 12 was the interactive. This was by Paper Terrace and it opens up this way. So you got to pull through and open up and you could put more in there, but I just did a real quick, quick one. This was day 12. Then on to the rest of the pages are journaling and planning. And then day 13 was from Kara Brandon Creations with a wraparound, which you can see, I think I actually put it on backwards, but I don't think it matters that much. It wraps around the page. Then on this one is belly band. So it's an interesting take on belly band for 14. You got the belly band here as well as here. And then you've got the different one on this side. So that was all from um, Maria's Miscellany. Then 15, which was the last one, is waterfall. And I did not even uh, embellish these. They can be used for pictures, memories, journaling. So you've got the waterfall here, and then I actually flipped over and made a waterfall on this side as well. So anyway, then the rest is just ready for me to finish out the year uh, or the month and may have to think about how I want to do it that way. So anyway, thanks so much for being a part of this. So